Hello, I'm Matt Guff from TheHouse.com, and this is a 2018 LibTech MC Bus in the Barrel Snowboard. This is a deck designed for and by Matt Cummins with a graphic done by a guy named Matt French. This is an early or mid-season release from LibTech uh, that kind of pays a homage to Matt Cummins and an old board that he used to have. This is an all mountain freestyle deck for intermediate to advanced level riders. Uh, a lot of people who kind of grew up riding in the in the 80, late 80s and early 90s definitely know who Matt Cummins is and knows uh, kind of what this graphic is kind of all about. One thing for sure though, it does feature not only a great graphic but a, a well-rounded shape as well. The noses outside the contact point, the nose and the tail seem to like kick up quite a bit more like those early style twin boards. This is a true twin board. You can ride it this way and this way. It's going to ride the exact same. It has a center stance and a wonderful profile shape called C2. That's why it rocks like this. There's actually a rocker in between the feet that give the board just a little bit looser of a feel. There's camber underneath each foot to the contact point that gives the board more, more position when you're on an edge and when you're ollieing. But overall, this is a really great freestyle deck that allows your riding to be a little bit more relaxed so you don't have to be so focused on like not catching an edge. Uh, the C2 profile shape is probably my most favorite. Uh, actually, I'd probably say that on all the LibTech boards because they all ride so well, but C2 is actually really good. Now the MC uh, bus in a barrel is actually a little bit stiffer than your average deck, about a six. Um, a little bit stiffer, not too much, but because of that rocker section in between the feet, it may feel just a little bit softer. There's an Aspen style wood core combined with Colombian gold. It's original horsepower, or the original uh, construction style technology, which is you know Aspen and Colombian gold, along with a Biax glass on bottom, which gives the board a nice smooth, consistent feel, and Triax glass on top, so it gives it a little bit more energy. Also, you'll notice that there's a kind of like an uprise as well. This uprise is kind of like impact style plates that give the strength underneath the bindings of just a little bit more. You know, these boards are ma made in America and of course they're made strong. That's why there's ultra high molecular weighted sidewall, birch internal sidewall. These boards are very, very strong. Uh, the base is actually a centered TNT base. It absorbs lots of wax, so make sure to keep it waxed up throughout the season. There's a radial style, style side cut, and then magnet traction edges. Magnet traction edges are large seven bump serrated knife-like blade edges that help to grip on really firm snow. So if you're a park rider and you ride like hard pack, this is gonna be a good board. If you actually wanna like ride in pow because the nose kick up, because that rock, rock and tape shape in between the feet, you can set the stance back and still kind of treat it as an all mountain board as well. But for the most part, it's a freestyle. Uh, deck. It's true twin centered stance. This is called the LibTech MC Bus in the Barrel. And of course, you can check it out at thehouse.com by selecting the link below. Leave a comment or question. Let us know what you think of the deck. And remember to subscribe to the channel there. And hopefully, I'll see you on snow. Peace.